Ever pondered about the stark differences between the Kumbu Icefall on Everest and the bottleneck on K2? These two locations, while both breathtaking in their own right, offer unique challenges to mountaineers across the globe. Let's delve into the details. Starting with the K2 bottleneck, it's a narrow gully situated at an astounding altitude of 26,900 feet, just a stone's throw away from the summit. This thin couloir is overhung by seracs along the edge of the ice field east of the summit. It's a must-pass for climbers since all four main routes cross it to reach the top. But traversing the bottleneck is no easy feat. Imagine climbing a steep gradient of 50 to 60 degrees, all while being exposed to the precarious seracs for about 330 feet. The high altitude only adds to the challenge. On the other hand, the Kumbu Icefall, located at the foot of the western Suyam on Everest, poses its own set of risks. This area, at 17,999 feet, is where the Kumbu Glacier rapidly recedes, leaving a two-and-a-half-mile-long icefall in its wake. The Kumbu Icefall is notorious for its slow but steady movement down the mountain, opening crevasses without warning and causing massive ice towers known as seracs to fall. These ice towers can range from the size of a refrigerator to that of a house. However, the Kumbu Icefall does present a silver lining. Its lower elevation allows climbers to ascend quickly and without supplemental oxygen. Plus, climbers can identify the dangerous sections, move through them swiftly and rest in safer spots. Both the K2 bottleneck and the Kumbu Icefall are undoubtedly uniquely challenging. The bottleneck, with its high altitude and steep gradient, presents a more unmanageable risk for climbers. The Kumbu Icefall, despite its lower altitude, is a treacherous terrain due to the constant movement of the glacier. However, its risks are somewhat more manageable as climbers can identify dangerous areas and move through them quickly. In conclusion, both the K2 bottleneck and the Kumbu Icefall pose significant risks to climbers, each with their unique challenges and hazards. Whether it's the high altitude steep gradient climb of the bottleneck or the shifting terrain of the Kumbu Icefall, mountaineers must navigate these areas with utmost caution. After all, in the world of mountaineering, preparation, knowledge and respect for the mountain are the keys to a successful climb.